Hi everyone, today I am going to show you something really exciting. We will explore how powerful DeepSeek is by creating a complete portfolio website in PHP using the DeepSkip capabilities. By the end of this video, you will have a fully functional portfolio website and a solid understanding of how DeepSeek can assist you in a web development. So let's get started. Before we jump into the coding, let me quickly introduce you to DeepSeek. DeepSeek is a versatile AI tool that can assist you with a wide range of tasks, especially in the fields of programming, data analysis, content creation, and problem solving. Now let's see how it can help us build a PHP based portfolio website from the scratch in a 5 minutes. To start this developing the website, you will need a code editor like the VS Code, a local server like XAMPP or the WAMP and uh, access to the DeepSeek. So let's get started. In the DeepSeek, I will add my prompt, create a portfolio website in PHP and hit the enter button. So first, it has mentioned the stu folder structure of our website. First, we need to create the this directory portfolio website. In that, create this folder slash CSS. In that CS CSS folder, we will add the styles.css. Then the images, if there is an image, we need to add in this image folder. After that, in the includes, we will add the header and the footer code and then these four pages index.php about projects and the contact so now we will start by adding this code in our website so first i will create the this portfolio folder in my st docs and i will open that folder in the VS code folder is open the first step is I will create this includes folder and in that includes folder I will add this header.php I will copy this code create the new folder includes and in this include folder create the header.php file and paste that code here and save the file next I will create this footer.php file in this include folder footer.php and paste that code and save the file next step is create the main page so this will be the index.php file copy this and in the root directory create the new file index.php and paste that code same way create the about.php about.php for the about us page paste that code after that this project.php file next is a contact.php and add this CSS in CSS slash style dot CSS file so first we will create the one more directory CSS in this folder I will create the styles dot CSS file and paste the CSS next file is the submit underscore form it will display the submitted data from the contact page so I will create this file as well submit underscore form new file submit underscore form dot php
now our all files are ready to check the website in the address bar add the path of your folder that is localhost slash portfolio and hit the enter button so here you can see the website looks like this on the home page you can see the message welcome to my portfolio in the about us page about me content in the projects we can add the completed projects and in the contact we can add these contact details and after submitting these details it will display these details so right now you can see this is very basic page and there is no content we can ask the dipseek to add the more content for about and the project page and also change the structure of this page so we can add the prompt like add the more content in each page also change the css of contact form so here you can see it is now adding the more content in each page so first i will update the content of my index.php file second add the content of about page third one is projects.php page and after that the or contact me form and it has updated the css as well so i will copy this css and will paste in the style.css and we will check the result first we will check this contact page so here you can see now that this form is looks little bit better and home page also it is looking much better than the previous one in the about the more details are added and in the projects this project details are added so you can ask the multiple queries like if you want to display these details in the card formats so we can ask the dipseek to change that page change the project structure and display the project details in cards format so it will now display the this project details in a cards format so i will copy this structure and paste it in our projects file save the file also copy the css and paste it and refresh the page so here you can see now this projects page structure is changed and these details are displayed in a card format in this way we can create the simple to the complex sites in php using the dipseek as well as the in other programming languages if you found this tutorial helpful don't forget to like comment and subscribe for more content like this and if you have used the dipseek before let me know your thoughts in the comments below thank you for watching